Hey guys, I'm Janet on occasion, and today we're attacking Cracker Raven's fake. I don't, I just don't understand why auto resolve things are going to lose all of our Chaos Warriors. It makes no sense. It makes no sense at all. We shouldn't be losing anyone against this, aren't we? And I'll prove it. Okay, so, uh, here's the Earth. So, yeah, a bunch of, bunch of chaps, a lot of artillery. Uh, these guys can vanguard, so I will. Uh, charging to the back of them is going to be incredibly beneficial to us. And we've got loads of flyers. Loads of flyers. So I think... Go on, I was holding control. I feel like my control button is acting up these days. I've been doing this so much lately. So you guys fly in. Uh, and then everyone else... Uh, now this is nice. Because those trees there... Should make it really hard for them to hit us, but we of course have that amazing firing arc on our units, which is um, obviously awesome. Okay. Iron breakers, iron breakers. Yeah, let's buff both of you. And let's get you over here. Right, we're probably going to lose a lot of these. Just like random cannon fire, but I'd rather these guys take damage and run away than like, you know, anything else happen, I guess. Have you run in, you run in, you run in, and you run in. Actually, let's have you use a nice little cheeky breath attack or something. Okay, brilliant. Uh, hit with that. Okay, cheeky breath attack. Need to find a position for the cheeky breath attack. Oh, I guess these guys work. And... Oh, Hawks of Mishka. Yeah, let's hit their leadership. without hitting our own guys. Love that. Alright, he's Portaglyph. Let's use one of these. Alright. Good. I knew you guys still haven't been hurt, so that's perfect. Uh, use another Doom Bolt, because I was using Doom Bolt before, and it just feels fun to keep using Doom Bolt. Actually, let's lower all their melee defense. Alright. This feels good. Final transmutation on the entire army. Alright, you guys, just sit tight, I guess. Okay. Don't fire at wheel or anything. And I think that's everybody. And you guys didn't even get through your area. Man, that's what I love about Siege. Any, like, easy battle. I turned you off fire at will, you silly goose. Anyway, any, uh, uh, like, overwhelming victory, you basically say no casualties, because if they just do a tickle of damage over your army, where they'd normally kill a unit or two, they're just damaging barrier. It's... It's so good. We lost 20 men. We lost 20 men total. Ooh, how much is good? Uh, and I think that was largely our hell cannons, actually. But one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, uh, 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 twelve, thirteen, fourteen. So we killed six. We killed six of them. All right. Uh, sacrifice captives. Ooh, these rank seven. I think we can upgrade our horses into knights. They were in a vanguard, but like that's fine. Don't more experience. How close are you guys? 2,000 away. 600 away. 1,600 away. Okay, they're, they're still very far away. Oh yeah, we can turn them into Doom Knights, can't we? At some point. Let's just, um, capture them. So, no upgrades yet. But soon. Helm of Discord. Can you have a helm? You can have whatever you like. Brilliant. Helm of Discord for you. Helm of Many Eyes feels very appropriate for him, though. 
But does he need giant melee defense? No, I think we just lower the enemy's stats. Um, give him an Ogre Blade. Give him pretty substantial damage, total. And the Doom Totem lowers enemy leadership, which I quite like. Yes, yeah, give that to him. To them. Okay, dead magic. We'll be able to get Scrolls of the Apocalypse next level up. That feels good. And you can get... I mean, we're still trying to get to Arcane Conduit for him. I feel like we're just making him hit harder, though, at this point. So I'm going to carry on doing that. Okay. So, uh, I can chase him down further. Um, I want to I get rid of these guys. I want to wipe out this faction. This might not be all they have left. They have four settlements left. Where the hell are there other settlements? They've got something going on down here. That's weird. Where the hell is Boris? Okay, well, sure. I guess it's not that important to get rid of this. Should probably deal with some of these dwarves. Well, dwarfs. Not dwarves. I know. A lot of people are going to say, no, it's dwarves. With a V. No, 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 it's not. Not in Warhammer. In Tolkien, it's dwarf dwarves. In Warhammer, it's dwarf dwarfs. True story. Uh, we lost four times as many men with the auto resolve as we lost <laughs> that first battle. Ridiculous. Uh, let's get Todheim. Or Death World, as it's known. Not called that. Yeah, and I guess we're occupying these places, huh? Uh, let's go with the replenish one. I like a good replenishment. So we're somehow not at war with these guys. And uh, these are person revivalists. Okay, interesting. Interesting. Anyway, we're going to conquer our way along here. Probably give the Norskins a bunch of this territory when I'm done with it, when I don't need the bonuses anymore. Uh, let's get Legion of Doom. Uzul. Good old Uzul. He's useful, probably. Or of Chaos gives him the missile resistance. That's actually very useful. And, uh... What are they going to do? Oh, yeah, I was going to make these guys knights. Uh, really, rank 7 isn't enough. They'd be rank 8. Flip it, heck. And I guess just because they're very low tier, you're skipping a tier, they have to go up in a big way. Chariots might be fun, but um, I want to rank 8 as well. Of course it's rank 8. Wait, hang on. I was going to say, of course it's rank 8. It's Siege. No, that's not... No, 8 is Korn's number. Right? Oh, I don't know. I forget the numbers. Uh, so these guys can be turned into knights, but I want my Chosen. I want my Chosen. So we can't upgrade anything, it seems. That's really sad. I mean, we can upgrade everything. Well, most things. But uh, not into things that I want. One day. One day, Trolltooth. And your brother, Trolltooth. Alright, so what is this guy going to do? Are we going to attack with Garrulous Algae Muncher? Or have Mentash Trolltooth push up instead? Not I think what I'm going to do, leave Garrulous here to replenish. Because this guy can't reach in a siege. They can't reach the siege. So we can do this other battle. Pyrrhic victory. That's far too high casualties. For my blood. Here, have extra leadership. Now? No, no, it still thinks that four, that four leadership didn't make much difference. Uh, <laughs> it was never gonna. Uh, yeah, I think we just attack. I mean, we've got, uh, like, Portaglyph to summon some harpies to just, like, get into that back line and bother them while we surround them with everything. So it's going to be a lot like that last battle we had. So yeah, let's get to it. All right, here's our army. Uh, should probably put you guys in the back. Ah, huh, it's annoying how that's cut off. Oh, we can deploy all back here though. Ooh, we can actually hide them in the trees. Okay, that's really nice. Okay, I enjoy that. That's going to really, really screw him up. Perfect. Okay, so that's really nice. Uh, we have a lot of Chaos Warriors of Slash now, which is really charming. Really good stuff. We can do that. Alright, and then, we're going to get the big boys. 
on the sides. And you lot are all going to hang out uh, in the middle. Alright. Well, let's go get him. And, uh... I've only got the one guy that can board a glyph, actually. I don't know why the sorcerers can't do it. I feel like they're supposed to be able to. But it just, it just doesn't. Yeah, let's spawn him now. Okay, there we go. And I kind of ignore these guys, if I'm being honest. Okay, let's try and get a cheeky little breath attack on these tree kin. Okay, that was a waste. Shame. Alright, let's jump down there then. Alright, we're going to lose all our guys here, aren't we? Probably. Go kill him. Alright, now where's my... I never use these. God's sake. Okay, let's hit them. Uh, this is a little bit of a mess. But these guys are available. Alright, let's go mess them up. Okay, let's go for them. How are you looking? You guys just need to run out there. You really do. Alright, go on. Play in despair. Alright, keep killing him. Uh, let's stop moving. Alright, let's get these guys over here. Keep chasing them, please. Uh, wow, he's just running for his life now, huh? It's pretty funny. And yeah, we are collapsing them back here. <laughs> Keep chasing them. Keep chasing them. Alright, we basically got them, haven't we? Yeah, these guys are all surrounded. Okay. Um. Don't even know what to attack, honestly. No idea. Okay, there we are. <laughs> He's getting away. Alright, let's go attack those tree kids. Okay, let's chase them down. And... Alright, they're getting whittled down. They're getting whittled down. These guys completely enveloped. Alright, head over there. Um, Alright, Hysterical Frenzy. Meant to do that on um, trolls rather than Chaos Spawn, but... Oh. Oh, that was lucky. If they'd hit that little, uh, I don't know, pod, whatever you want to call it, it would have been pretty bad. Alright, I know this probably isn't going to do much, but I'm going to try. Oh, okay, he's actually running in. That is an ecumenical matter. Alright, let's get him. Okay, you go for them, you keep chasing these guys. You can chase them down. Alright, that's the army. That's the Wow, we killed him. Okay, that was quick. Once we had him pinned down there. Just 1.2k damage for Mentas. Troll Tooth. Yeah, okay. You know what? I enjoy Mentash. I did not realize he did that much damage. Hell yeah. Alright, close victory. Alright, we lost 65 men. Nice. Uh, let's sacrifice the captives again. Uh, oh, they all went a rank up again. Love to see it. Uh, this, wait, is 5 high enough? God, I can't remember. I can never remember. I can never remember. Let's take a look. 
We can indeed get more Chaos Warriors with Hell School Shooters. Just one left. One less left to upgrade. And yeah, you guys, God, it's going to be a long time. Please get to rank six. But hey, we're getting there. Uh, ooh, can I reach him too? I can reach him too. It will mean that this guy will be free to attack me. But the damage we've taken has been pretty limited. So I think we might be able to just get attacked and not really care. You know? Alright, let's get Infernal Champion. I want to start a game like Woundmaker and just see how big damage we can get on this guy. Because I think it's largely, he's got the Sword of Anti-Heroes. Activating that is huge. And he also has, uh, yeah, Heroic Killing Blow as well. So both of those, it doubles his damage, you know. So it's pretty massive. So if we can get that to really high, ooh, it's going to be fun. Uh, oh, that's a good point. We can't just give him, like, a bigger weapon. Because we really want the Sword of Anti-Heroes to do his thing. So I can't give him a better weapon to, like, put up his base damage. But he has loads of skill points left to put up, so... Yeah, he's pretty pretty powerful. Uh, more scouting, I think, actually, for him. Now let's kill them. This guy's probably going to try and run away. And, uh... They're still a bit stuck. They need to attack Bragnir again before they can do anything. There's a lot going on over on this side, which we have no counter for. Which makes me wonder if I need to actually get our Nurgle army over here. But a Nurgly army... You know, as slow as Nurgle is, I wonder if that's appropriate. Uh, let's see, these all put up income, don't they? They do. So, seeing as how we're rolling in money, we may as well just get those built. Uh, let's get one of them built. So, where do I want the Nurgle army? I need to get good units in it from the beginning, though. So, I think actually I need to get in that Nurgle army over here. We're going to get the guy we had before. Uh, this guy, Putris. It has you know what? I can get Rude Marcher on that guy, because we need it. <laughs> we we need it. Alright, only 15% chance to fill this up. God, that's annoying. Let's get a couple trolls. Um, and then I guess just a bunch of marauders, right? Let's start working on them. Yeah. I suppose. There's some Chaos Spawn, get some Chaos Spawn and Nurgle. And some Forsaken and Nurgle, and some Horsemen of Nurgle. Do you have Horsemen of Nurgle? Probably not. And if we go to the Poxmakers of Nurgle, we can get some interesting units. Uh, Plague Toads don't cost much. That would actually be kind of nice. We can get four of them. That's actually a really good start for a Nurgle army. So let's see, Nurgle. Okay, no Nurgle trolls. Oh, and you can't get Chaos Spawn of Nurgle. We've, we've had Chaos Spawn of Nurgle. So I guess you have to have a Nurgly thing before you can turn into Chaos Spawn. You can't go sideways. How weird. Huh. Alright, so do you want to go Great Weapons or no? Uh. Not sure, actually. Not sure. Maybe just normal ones. Maybe just normal ones. Go for sort of survivability more than anything else. And then we'll go with maybe great weapons on these Chaos Warriors. And then, you know, just for sake of Nurgle. Only one way to go there. And we can get throwing axes of Nurgle, the poison. That's fun. Can't get Nurgly um, aspiring champions, though. Uh, so this is actually a full army, I just realised. We made a full stack. But we do actually want some more heroes. Uh, iron skin, pretty good. And scaled skin. Just, yeah, weird skin conditions. That's very nurgly. So, okay, let's do that. And, um... Do we actually want to get rid of a couple of the marauders? Because... Yeah, let's get rid of the chaos pawn, because we can never make that nurgly. Armor trolls, we can't make nurgly, but they feel quite nurgly anyway. Uh, so let's get rid of one of these. And then with the Plague Toads, I think we're going to have a pretty cool army. So a bunch of... A bunch of all sorts, frankly. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yep. <laughs> Don't know why it tells us everything twice. But it does. Uh, let's do Nuggle. And... Nuggle. And... 
I actually think we should do this guy to Nurgle now. Let's go full Nurgle. Because we have no Nurgle. We have no Nurgle army. So, let's give him Root Marcher, Dominating Presence, and Chaos Rank Guard. Alright, it's going to take a while to get all the stuff. Um, this army all leveled up and everything, but... Yeah, I think the Plague Toads are going to help a lot. Uh, let's go hard to hit. Resilience is the name of the game. With these guys. And Blade Master. Yeah, I think we need to go training, actually, as well with these guys. So there we go. Nice little Nurgle army. Obviously, really cool looking army. Straight away. You know, shame I can't pronounce the guy's name. <laughs> That's always a pity. Okay, let's kill them. I don't think he can do anything. I am worried I'm going to auto-resolve. We're going to end up with basically everyone dead, though. Or, you know, everyone nearly dead. Though, how far can they reach? Oh, we can't reach very far from here. Distraction for all. So I guess that's that. But uh, yeah, they might attack us, they might not. Uh, I think they could do some pretty serious harm if they did attack us, but given the amount of Chaos Warriors we have now, they can soak up so much damage from Gladeguard. Gladeguard don't have a lot of armor piercing. You know, nothing here has a lot of armor piercing except the heroes, really. And they're low levels, so not the buffs either. Regarding gem sounds lovely. Yeah, I've got a bunch of other toys too. Okay. So yeah, these two armies have been absolutely crushing it. That's what, four armies? I think we destroyed in two turns. That's pretty good. God, Oleg really needs to recover in a hurry. Because there's so many orcs. As soon as we get rid of these stacks, which are going boo 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 boo, it's all fine. But like the fact they have a pile of stuff all in one place makes it so difficult to deal with them. Uh, oh, and you guys haven't moved, have you? Oh no, he has. He hasn't. Well, he has. He moved to catch up. But I guess you're just going to sit tight for now, then. Okay. You're going to sit tight. I think that means everyone else is done. I mean, I guess I'll build that, because I can. Sure. Moving on. They did decide to attack. Wait. This is a different army. There was just another army hanging around. Because the army I was looking at was just mostly Glade Guard. So where the hell did you come from? I mean, I can't retreat. And then we'll see what happens. And now, now I have to fight two armies. Why did I run away? So that one's tired. Crap. Crappity, crappity, crap. Still losing about the same amount of units, though. Uh, they're both very low level. God, that was a mistake. I should have just fought this army. I really should have just fought that army. Then they would have attacked me afterwards. I just can't believe another army showed up. You know? There's just so many. And they, a bunch of them keep going in ambush stance, I assume. So I'm just not seeing them. I'm not planning for them. God, this is going to be rough. All right, let's get to it. Okay, it's another quite frustrating one, in that it's a choke point battle, so I can't really rush them. Because I'm going to end up stuck in this little gap. Um, I mean, we've got some ways of, of exploiting their, um, their nonsense, which is good. Right, let's get you in here. You can sit tight over there. Uh, we have all our cavalry, which I would love to put outside here somewhere. I wonder how close I can get there. Maybe I'll just sit tight over here. It's really just wait for stuff to break and then they can run in and be a problem. That's kind of what I want to do. I mean, those are just marauders of Slanesh. So, let's go with them. There. These guys here. And yeah, new guys can hang out there too. Alright, so I want them to have to try and push into here. So I'm just shouting Nurgle's Pestilent Glory. I guess it's the aspiring champions. I would assume. But yeah, I need them to come in here and try and get into this bit. So I can flank them with them. And uh, if I put him in here then maybe I can get the spells in over here a bit better. 
Uh, so all this stuff is hidden, right? He's not. He doesn't hide. He doesn't hide. Let's put him in here. Yeah, all that stuff is hidden. And those guys are hidden. These guys are not hidden. Well, he's hidden. Pain! And despair. Pain. <laughs> really? I don't know what he's doing there. I was very excited. Pain! Having a great time, that guy. Okay, so they're moving into position. Huh. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, yeah, he's gonna, he's gonna shoot some of my warriors. Ooh, it stings. Jerks. I don't think I can afford to get him close and, like, gobble anyone up. There's too much archer fire that I'll end up eating. Even if I do use, like, Hortoglyph, you know? So I think they're gonna make me wait. Okay, here come the others. Got they got dragons too. And oh, the amount of heroes. Christ! The amount of heroes they've got here is obscene. We're gonna take so much damage before it even starts. This is gonna be really difficult. I do not like my odds. Okay, come on. Yep, even more. How many have we lost so far? We've lost 200 men. We've lost 200 men. Already. And those hawks are going to fly over and they're going to see all the guys we have in here. Okay. Dark Princess Meliodas. Okay. Okay, that'll have to do. That'll have to do. Yep, no spotted me. Alright, there's still some units back here. Move up and around. Okay. Go get him. Go get him. Okay, let's try and get a cheeky breath attack in there. Don't quite know how that's going to go. And now for the pendulum, which I can't really tell where to put it, honestly. It's all a bit of a... It's all a bit of a mess. Oh my god. Our cavalry is also already getting wrecked. And him. Uh, cavort! Cavort! Alright, let's hit them. Alright, you know what? Let's go for that forest dragon. And, I mean, they're trying to help. Bless them. Uh, hysterical Frenzy. Let's do that on someone. Alright, how are you going? You have barely touched these guys yet. Yeah, just too many archers. I can't get into them. I can't get into their archers. Yeah, just can't get into their archers. What am I supposed to do about their archers? Let's get you out. You're being deep after right now, which is a pain. I'm going to go for their lord, I think. Or for these wild riders. Uh, I can lower enemy leadership, I suppose. Those dryads look like they're about to go. Ooh, this could work out nicely for us. Although well, it might work out terribly for us. And yeah, we've got nothing left over there. Uh, let's try and hit them again. Alright, we got some damage in here by the looks of it. Ooh, boy. You're still alive. Somehow. I'm gonna deal with them. No, no, no. Come deal with him, please. Alright, more Portoglyph. And we're nearly dead over here, which is bad news. Alright, 
So let's get you in here. Try and help. That rear charge might be what we need. Okay, that guy's getting hurt. Let's buff our boys. Alright, let's bring you guys out into here. Okay, that seems to be working out okay. Uh, they're all running. Alright, Chaos Boys are some nice. Just push you into their boys, okay? I still got that dragon. He's very annoying. Almost got the little sod. Come on, one big hit. Okay, let's hit these guys again. Let's use hysterical frenzy on these guys so they can get through these wall dances. Okay, now... Try and get another cheeky attack on them. Oh, Marky's down. Marky is down. Try and kill this other dragon of theirs. Okay, we do big damage. But we're also getting shot at by a thousand guys. Okay, let's try and hit them again. Okay, big buffed melee attack. Let's go. 127 melee attack. Come on, can't miss. Can't miss. We can't miss. Alright, hysterical frenzy. I need these guys to cut through here. Guys, Azroy Spear's still going. Okay. We're doing great with you. Let's go for this waste stalker, okay? Need that big damage. Need the big damage on the big boys. Flippin' heck. I cannot believe we're still in this fight. <laughs> Honestly, shockingly impressed with how well our boys are holding. Alright, more melee attack, more melee defense, please. I need to pull back. I need I need to like get a rear charge into these guys or something. Azavar needs to get out of there. Mentash needs to get out of there. Okay, let's get you in here. Alright, more damage please. And you know what? Hysterical Frenzy, okay? Hysterical Frenzy, I want you to do more damage than is humanly possible. Yeah, like that. Perfect. Alright, you guys are kind of in my way. Okay, let's charge into this lot. You guys, maybe don't just stand there getting shot. Come on, big, big... Big gnomes, come on. Big gnomes. Alright, that guy's dead. Huge damage there. We're still fighting these Azurite Spears. They got down to the last four. That's crazy. Okay, we lost the Marquis of Madness, or whatever the hell his name is. Uh, we've kept our wizard somehow. Kept our wizard somehow. Oh boy. Uh, Trekin. Let's try and kill these Trekin. Wow. Alright, we lost a lot. But a lot more survived. Honestly, Chaos Warriors with Hell Scorches. The huge um, missile block chance and the huge armor. Like, it just seems they are. They're just too bloody resilient, frankly. And huge melee defense, too, actually, at 62. So, there's that. <laughs> I don't know what good that's going to do, but. Phew. Alright, let's kill some more tree kin. Alright, how much damage did you end up doing, Mentash? 23,000 damage. That's good lad. Good lad. Okay, we got him. Perfect victory. So, we were supposed to fight one enemy. We ended up fighting two stacks. And that was after we fought a stack and change with this army. So we got rid of a stack and change. Oh, actually, a stack and change twice. It was two two like busted up armies, a full army, and then we just fought a further two armies, and he hasn't got a single turn of replenishment yet. 
Okay, so one thing I was thinking. But, need to kind of correct. So I was just thinking, we only lost 339 men total, and we lost like 200 before they even started attacking us. But actually, it it's the total amount that you could have in your army, not your starting number. We already had an injured army. So, you know, so we lost a bit more than like 100 in the melee. But it also means that their um, Arrows of Kernos did a lot less damage than I thought they had. But we did lose three units. Unfortunately, we lost two of our cavalry, which is really frustrating because... I mean, I've worked so hard to try and rank these guys up to get them to, you know... Uh, I wanted a bunch of Knights of Sinch. Uh, not really, Knights of Slanesh. And I'm just not there yet, which is annoying. And the Marquis of Masochism? Can't replace him easily. Yeah, well, we can, but, like, not quickly. We have to wait a bunch of time. So, bit it, bit annoying. But, that's two more armies dealt with. Okay, unbridled ferocity or overpowering force are our options here. Unruly vassals have risen to question your might. Dude, I'm killing everything. Come on. Did you uh, put on a demonstration of strength or challenge them directly? That's my little charming face. Like, hey guys, I hear you're being unruly. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm just. I'm just here for a friendly conversation. Stab. That's what he sounds like, by the way. In case you're wondering. Uh, let's go with overpowering force. Uh, send in the enforcers. Use a more direct approach to make the vassals reaffirm their loyalty to you. Follows Nagash in the Jade Court just got wiped out. Bilgin, we spotted his ambush, apparently. It sent me to the faction because the guy's dead. We killed him. Hilarious. Uh, oh god, look at all this damage. Alright, here we are. So they're still there. Uh, but Vilgin didn't, didn't survive. Because he was in March stance, wasn't he, when he attacked? These guys did manage to escape Bragnir. Okay, interesting. Uh, Garrulous Elgi Muncher could go... Wow, that's actually a pretty good army. Uh, could go and stop them. But I wonder if I want to sit tight for a second. Not sure. So we killed a bunch. Got a Chaos Wall Shrine for Azavar, which I immediately need to tell him to, to not be on. Don't do that. Chaos Steed, please. Thank you. Uh, spell Shield? Is that worth doing? I need just extra 20 armor. Oh, the Helm of Many Eyes is quite nice. Let's give him that. That'll help. And, oh, and you can have a student too. Cool. So that'll do. Um, now is chaos. Let's see here. I mean, thick skinned would really help. He's actually really low armor. Because uh, Chaos Dragons don't have a lot of armor. So I think we do actually need to bolster that. And then we'll have him um, hit more effectively. So we can get that damage to register. Uh, I mean, more cooldown on spells is pretty good when we are just using the same spells a bunch. But making them a bit better in a fight might be nice. Hydra speed to hear his army. Yeah, that's been really useful. Uh, could spread more corruption. Or we could get some of these more interesting spells. Phantasmagoria stops enemies from moving, which I really enjoy. Close leadership too. And uh, slicing shards just does a bunch of damage. Big armor piercing too. Yeah, okay, let's go slicing shards. That would have been really useful in that last fight. Uh, maybe I just want to sit these two guys together for now. You know? Do we want that? Maybe. And let's find out. What can I get? We can get a bunch of Marauders. Ugh. Come on. I want some Chaos Warriors. You can never get Chosen. Never just hire Chosen. Oh my god, I spent all my money, did I? Okay. Let's not upgrade that, because it's kind of pointless. Um, Mentash. I mean, I could get more Aspiring Champions. That would actually be pretty good. Because they are good. And I suppose I do actually need more Cavalry, don't I? So, you know what? That's fine. Um, Slanesh. This is going to take some doing. So I need to get to rank 3, and then I need to get to rank 6 or something. Uh, yeah, rank six. God, it's gonna take so long. God, what is the plan here? I mean, I can get rid of them easily enough. An impossible uh, I feel like all this territory is gonna get taken back pretty quickly, but Findol and Valnal are both on the way. Uh, and Teveril and An Astrid and Katra. Although. Osborn? Still fine-ish. Nope, still tier 5. Okay, it fought them off. That's great news. 
Uh, and how are we doing over here? Oh my god, this guy's on his own. What an idiot. Okay, good. We can get rid of one of the armies. There's still so many. But yeah, we can get rid of one of the armies here. And hopefully level up our, our marauders. That would be nice. And, uh, and also our marauder horsemen. So, you know. Yay? <laughs> yes! Yay! Pyrrhic victory. Are you kidding me? This is not going to be a Pyrrhic victory, okay? It's going to be great. Unfortunately, we're at 45 minutes again. Like, the amount of battles we're having. Um, I think this is like two episodes per <laughs> per turn right now, which is just insane. Uh, we might we might need to get, like, double stacks of stuff. Just make sure we always have a couple stacks, so there's always the option to just, like, just goon the enemy. Just get a couple of guys um, on top of the enemy and just deal with them quick. That sounded way more sexual than I was going for. But anyway, um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna carry this on uh, next episode. So guys, if you're enjoying this, please do comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, guys.